Hello viewers, welcome to Jess and Chemi's channel. In today's video we will show you how to fully access your PLDT Fiber Admin settings. This is working as of July 15, 2019, with the router software RP2631. For this type of router. So sit back and take notes. But before I start, make sure to subscribe to our channel and don't forget to click the notification bell to be notified of new videos and new updates. It will really be a big help to us. Thank you! Let's start by opening a browser. Like our other tutorials, you can also do this in your mobile phone's browser. But to make it easier, we are doing it in a computer. Next is to enter this address. You can just copy it from the description box below. The login screen should appear. This time we will use this username and password. It is also in the description box below. Hopefully this will last because PLDT might update it again. Once successful, this is what you should see. You will see here the Restore All menu, and Debug Switch menu. Next is to click the Debug Switch menu. Check Enable on the Telnet switch, then click Apply. Also in the Web Admin switch click Enable and Apply. After that, open a command prompt. And then type in the phrase, Telnet 192.168.1.1. Then press Enter. And if you receive this error, go to Control Panel, and search Features in Search Bar then click Turn Windows Features on or off. Then on this window search for Telnet Client, and put a check on it, then click OK. Now you have to wait because it may take a few minutes to finish. Once done, again type in the phrase, Telnet 192.168.1.1. This time this is what you should see. Now you should log in using Jipin as the username and password. Once user appears, type in Enable and click Enter. And then type the password again which is Jipin. Then config should appear. Next type CD Web, and press Enter. Next type in Get Web Admin Username Admin PLDT, then press Enter. And there it is! It is the password for accessing the full admin settings. Okay! Put this in a notepad to make things easier. And we will try it now. Again use this URL to go to the login page. Type in admin PLDT as the username, and copy the long password from our notepad. Yes! This is what you should see if it's successful. So since this is the initial setup we need to create a new password. Okay, so paste in the old password and type in a new preferred one. Retype in the password and click apply. Click back, and let's try to log in again. This time use admin PLDT and type in your new password. And there you go! Congratulations! You now have access to all your router's awesome features. Hopefully this video helped you a lot, but remember though, PLDT might void your warranty because of this. Nevertheless make sure to subscribe to our channel. Hit the like button as well. Thank you very much! If you have questions comment it down below or reach us through our Facebook page Chess and Chemi's Tips. Thank you again. Bye.